go to a football game, you watch a football game on TV, someone kicks a field goal or an extra point. If you see a sign behind that, what does it say? John 3.16. What is John 3.16? For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son so that everyone who believes in him might not perish but might have eternal life. We just read that as today's gospel. We see it all over the place. John 3.16. We just read it and heard it. We say it. We know it. And it's everyday stuff. Even the opening prayer. As we recall year by year the mysteries. As we recall year by year it kind of gets the impression that this is something that we do often, which is wonderful. But is it everyday happen stuff? Is this stuff that just comes and goes? And yes, we are so familiar with it that it's just this opening prayer, as we recall year by year the mysteries of the resurrection of our Savior. God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son that everything changed because of this one event. John 3.16 stands out as like the mission statement for our faith. Because without him, there is not heaven. Without him, there is no hope for us. But with him, everything changes. He changes our life, and we don't even know it. He has opened up a way for us, and we take it for granted. Year by year, we do this, and year by year, we do that. And we see John 3.16, and it means nothing, but it has changed us. Let us allow how it changes how we live. Let us let this event, this feast that we continue to celebrate year by year, let us grow closer to him because of it and not allow it to become something that we do every year and whatever. It's not whatever. It's everything. Because without him, there is no hope. With him, there is every great gift. Let's live it, brothers and sisters. If we're worried that the world celebrates July 4th because Easter... Let's live Easter in us so that the world has no choice but to celebrate Easter through the penny cost. So brothers and sisters, let's live this season so that year by year we grow closer to him so that one day we'll be with him in the place that he promises to those who believe in the only begotten son, the great gift of heaven. Please stand.